What's going on YouTube? I'm the white guy and today we're going to be showing you how to do just a very quick video of how to install MX versus ATV Reflex custom tracks. First thing, I'm going to do quick, quick about this. First thing you do, you go to this twisteddirt.com website, navigate the forums, this will also be linked in the description for you. Just come to this page right here, going to click here, download the beta track DLC files, which you'll get a folder called MX tables right there. The next thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to come, let's get rid of this window, actually I'm going to leave that there for now. Uh, you're going to come to either mxmaniacs.com, then you can browse for tracks in this little bar right there, which I'm motioning to with my hand right now, but you can't see my hand, but you can see my mouse. So that little bar right there. Or you can go to reflexcentral.com. I'd recommend bookmarking both of these if you're going to be doing a lot of custom tracks, because not every most people will post their tracks on both websites, but not everybody does. But this is where you get your custom tracks. Reflex Central is all reflex tracks, and obviously, and then this uh, Ma MX Maniacs is anything from MX Simulator to Unleashed to Reflex. So if either you want a reflex track, you're going to pick the reflex track and download it, which I'm not going to download right now because, as I will show you in a moment, I have lots of folders downloaded. Uh, just ignore the desktop there. I totally don't pirate anything. Okay, let's get that opened up there. Now what you're going to want to do is navigate to this folder. You can also minimize this as well. And somewhere is this thing wants downloads. Yes. I need to, I'm just going to half screen it this way. Gonna locate this location, or you can just type this into your little browser bar in Windows Explorer. I'm assuming you're using Windows. You're watching this. If you're using Mac or Linux, uh, you'll probably know what to do. You locate your folder. This way is where the Steam's default location is at, right there. Or you can go into your Steam, your library. Just right-click the game, go to Properties, and hit Browse Local Files. That will also pop this up. Then once you get into their local files, you will be in this spot right here. Uh, do not mess with anything in here, or you could break stuff. There is some other things that there's like a first person camera mod by Jamie T and a 15 million credit save file by J that Jamie T also posted that you'd install a different way than custom tracks. This is also how you install custom skins, but I'm not going to be showing how to do that because if you want to do custom skins, there's, they have README files in the custom skins when you download them. And I actually don't want to show you how to do that because you can break your game doing that, and I do not want to be responsible for anybody breaking their game. So I apologize, but I'm not going to show you that for that reason. But anyway, you come to your database folder, and then you'll this MX tables file that you downloaded, you just take that out, and then you just move it into your database, which I'm not going to do because I've already done that. But you just you have to have WinRAR, and so at least I use WinRAR. You could have like 7-zip or something, I guess that'd work. You just take these files right there, and you copy it over into there. Then once you've done that, you'll have your beta tracks. You can open up your MX versus ATV Reflex to see that you're, you see like beta slot, whatever. That should be unlocked in your game, and then to install custom tracks, you would just go to whatever the, either the two websites I showed before, which is MX Maniacs or just Reflex Central. Pick a track, download it. I have all pretty much every track on there, just in this little folder right here. Which let's see, which one should I install? Let's install this SN National track. This is all you do, right? So when you have WinRAR, you just double click it. Ready? Ready for this? Ready for this? This is really advanced power PC usage. Ready? Hope you're ready for this stuff because this is really complicated. And then, since I already have a track installed, I'm just going to move and replace. And then I've installed a custom track, and I just have to go boot up the game and play beta slot one. And that's pretty much it. I'm not going to make this video any longer because it honestly doesn't need to be. It's pretty simple to do this, and hopefully, you guys learn something here. So, yeah. But I'm running out of things to say now. But anyway, I'm the white guy. I'll see you guys in another video. Hopefully, sometime soon.